it's your boy down low back for another reply. But before then, let's talk about something that's going on in the music industry, man. So Kendrick Lamar is getting sued again for that Section 80. This time it's for rigor mortis for the damn sample that he used. And this is just what I've been saying, man. You cannot be sampling people's shit. It doesn't matter if you're not famous then. Or even if you wasn't even selling your project, man. If you end up blowing up like Kendrick Lamar did, all of these motherfuckers is coming back to get the money that he's getting now. But anyway, on to today's reply, and today's reply is to that Flying Lotus featuring Kendrick Lamar. That never catch me, and you know what, man, honestly, it's cool, I'm not even that huge of a Flying Lotus fan or anything, man. But I do like the complimentary of styles here, like the complexity of the beats from Flying Lotus, and the complexity of the lyrics from Kendrick Lamar. Came together just right off of this track, man, and the way they balanced it, man, is... Half of it is like showcase of just the beats, and the other half is just the track. Now, I definitely think people are taking it a bit too fucking far. Like, you start reading comics, you'll be like, oh, this one song shitted on Drake's entire career. And all of that dick riding slash hating at the same damn time shit. The song is cool. It ain't all that, motherfucker. But still, I do recommend people to go ahead and peep it out. It's a solid listen. But anyway, on to today's article from DownloadPass.com. And today's article is about how you get what you put in. Because here's the thing that most rappers want to do, man. You want to put in 15 fucking minutes of grinding and get a lifetime supply of benefits. How the fuck does that even exist in this world today? It doesn't, man. I mean, because you look at your job, man, you put in 40 hours worth of work in order to get a fucking paycheck. But rappers fuck that up, man. It's like they put in 40 hours of a fucking job, but then they don't expect really a paycheck off of it. They really expect to become the CEO of the fucking corporation and shit. See, you gotta understand, man, you get what you put in on this shit, and then you got to understand what the fucking work is actually going to give you. See, because you put in all this time in the music studio and shit, recording songs, what the fuck is that actually giving you? It's not success in the music industry. What that work is going to give you is more fucking songs. What is success in the music industry, man? Success is people buying your shit so that you can provide for your own. So therefore, doesn't it make sense to put in work on finding all of the fans that's going to like your shit, right? I mean, having music is a key part of it, but the most important aspect is getting to these fucking people and that's the kind of work that people need to be putting in i hope you enjoyed the show you can follow me at twitter up there and you can go to downloadpads.com that's down there to read today's article